Hello, this is founder Ray Rune. I am using Fantasy Grounds Unity Beta. The date is 4-16-2020. This is going to be a series of videos in a tutorial series that will help you learn how to set up for a game using Fantasy Grounds Unity. Most of this content is covered in the Fantasy Grounds Classic. However, there are a few subtle differences and I will attempt my best to give you short, um, immediate, and accurate setup notes for your campaign in this particular video. So this is Fantasy Grounds Unity series uh, for Unity Beta. This will be set up for part one. So when we first launch Fantasy Grounds, we are faced with this setup screen. This will assume that you've already gone into the settings and put in your user ID and your license number and that you already have content. If you don't already have content, then some of this will make sense to you, some of it will not. The other thing is I'm using the D&D 5e rule set, so setup might be different for other rule sets, but all in all, the DM size should be fairly similar. So with that in mind, I'm gonna go ahead and create a new campaign, and this is the campaign I'm gonna use for this video series. So the first thing I'm gonna do is select the 5e rule set, which is down here under the game systems rule set. The other thing I'm going to set is if it's going to be private or listed publicly, I'm just going to put it on land because it's going to be a private session. And up here, I'm going to put the FGU DM series just so I kind of remember what the campaign was. So I'm just going to use my username. And then if you want to load any extensions, uh, you may do so at this time. The only one I think I'm going to load is the Montserrat, which I know was written for Unity. And probably just maybe one of the themes but i don't i don't even know i'm going to load that the less you load here the less complicated it is if you are using extensions from classic make sure that they work with unity before you start playing a lot of people are trying to do what they used to with with classic and it's not quite working out so also in this, this tutorial um i'm going to be showing other things but for right now that is just the beginning and then i go ahead and hit start and that will start up the video or it will start up the feed. We'll come right back after this.